All right, so you used one lifeline. Good for Dana. You got $32,000. You can't leave here with less than that. We're going for $64,000. We're five away from a million. Let's play. By what name has television host Don Herbert been known since 1951? Buffalo Bob, Bozo the Clown, Mr. Rogers, Mr. Wizard. I think I'd like to use the 50-50. 50-50. All right, you want to narrow it down? Computer, take away two of the wrong answers for Bob, leaving one wrong answer and the correct one. Bozo the Clown or what? Mr. Wizard? Don Herb. Um, I'm not for sure what Bozo the Clown's name is, but I know it's not Don Herbert. So my answer is D, Mr. Wizard. Final answer? Final answer. Yes, Don Herbert, Mr. Wizard, since 1951, you won 64,000. You won 64,000, that's great. We're going for 125,000, you're four away from a million. Here it is for $125,000. What was the second state to be officially admitted into the Union? Connecticut, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware, second state. Well, I know Delaware was the first state. I'm sure of that. I have an idea of who the state is, but since we're in New York, um, I'd like to pull the audience. All right, audience, Bob needs your help. Here we go. On your keypads. Using A, B, C, or D, please vote now. Fifty-four percent say it's Pennsylvania. New Jersey came in uh, second with uh, 20 percent. I had thought it was New Jersey. Fifty-four percent of the audience feels it's uh, Pennsylvania. And you said the audience is correct ninety-two percent? Ninety-two percent of the time. I still think it's New Jersey, but it's hard to go against fifty-four percent of the audience. They're right ninety-two percent of the time. Right. Let's hope their percentage goes up. I want to say C, Pennsylvania. Boy, they better be right, huh? They better be. Oh, we're going to spray them. Oh, we're going to spray them with a hose right now. Yes. Want to make that your final answer? Yeah, I'll make it my final answer. All right, you had 64,000. Now you got 125,000 up. When we come back, we're going to look at the $250,000 question. All righty, Bob, there it is. Quite a story here. Bob Schick, the firefighter from uh, Lancaster, Ohio. Also a paramedic, and as a matter of fact, in the course of duty, you save somebody's life. Now, yes. when that happens, do you ever stay in touch with those people? Um, Sometimes. Yeah. In this particular case? Um, in this particular case, the gentleman, we've had him a couple times since then, but the saves really stand out because you lose so many. Yeah. Oh, really? So. Yeah. Well, I'm sure he never forgot you. All right, Bob, uh, you're going for $250,000. All the lifelines are gone here, and if you miss this, you'll lose $93,000. But we're in serious money here. It's a quarter million dollars. You ready to play? Yes. Okay, let's do it. Let's get on with it. Let's play for $250,000. 
Which of the following nations changed its name to Myanmar in 1989? Burma, Kiribati, Liberia, Bhutan. Let's try to work this one out. I really don't have a clue. All right. Yeah. Let's let's uh, talk about. It. I don't believe it's Liberia. I believe Liberia still goes by that name. Mm -hmm. uh, but I could be wrong. I was wrong about the audience. So. Um, I've never never heard of Kiribati. Bhutan. No. Burma? That's what I'm leaning towards, but this is a, a lot of money to risk on a hunch. Well, it happened 11 years ago, Myanmar. What would you do with this money if you wanted? Um, I'd like to buy some land in the country and, and build a home there. Sure. 250,000 I'm sure would uh, go a long way. 125,000 yeah. go a long way too. Um, I'm sure this is one of the things I read in the almanac that I've forgotten the past two days. Mm -hmm. um, let's give someone else a chance. I'm going to stop at 125. Yeah? Yes. You sure now? Yes, I'm sure. Could it be your final decision? Final decision. Well, that's good. You won $125,000. The answer is Burma. You would have won $250,000. But that's okay. That's all right. $125,000. Hey, Bob, you were a great contestant. Good luck to you, okay? Good. Well, there's a man, a firefighter, who never dreamed of being on a television game show. He called our toll-free phone line, qualified, was flown here to New York City, where he just won an amount of money that is going to significantly impact his life. We're happy about that. And you could be here, too. So when the phone lines open up again in a couple of weeks, why don't you just make that call, okay?